with the Discovery Expedition of St. Charles, and we're filming a series of uh, shorts about the Lewis and Clark Expedition. Action. Or prepare. What we're doing is we're taking excerpts out from the journals, directly from the journals. We have so many people, they don't realize how much Lewis and Clark changed the history of the United States. Plane presses around my back. In this episode, we're focusing on the change of command from one sergeant okay. who had died of appendicitis, the only person who died on the expedition, to the uh, new sergeant, Sergeant Gass. It looks good here. Yeah. So let's move our oars back. At the end of the year, we're going to have probably about 10 episodes. So the objective is to put this all together in episodes that can be viewed on the internet and for remote educational learning. Uh, the boat is a replica as close as could be found using records from the Smithsonian of the keel boat that was used on the Lewis and Clark expedition. It was built in the 1990s and actually from 2003 to 2006 our group reenacted the whole expedition using the boats, using the men, trying to follow the journals of Lewis and Clark to the day. It's very rewarding to most of us because we've all got a passion for this thing and trying to teach history. One of the challenges is of course being historically accurate, having everyone dressed the way that would be realistic, keeping the inventory together is a huge challenge. Uh, in 2015 we were partnering with HBO. They had planned a Lewis and Clark series. And so this boat and our other two boats went up to Canada. We're having internal problems and, and, and the movie never came out. But we also wound up with a lot of the props, uniforms and other gear from the HBO shoot. What we're trying to do is get some of the younger guys involved and, and uh, see if we can get them interested in history because uh, when I'm gone, who's going to talk about John Coulter and and beaver and stuff like that. So we're trying to educate some of the younger ones because uh, it is part of our history and very important. We're just extremely proud to be carrying on the living history of Lewis and Clark. Or salute!